Imagine you spawn into a world. In this world you find that there are many things you can do. You can chop wood, you can mine, you can dig, you can do all kinds of things. And so you explore, you have fun, and slowly you start to discover that there are rules to this world. That the whole world is made of these things called blocks. And there seems to be some kind of gravity that pulls you down. And you can create totally new things by combining old ones. It seems like you're discovering the truth of this world. Of course, from our perspective, it seems obvious that this world is created because it's Minecraft. But let's say Steve here, he goes and he tries to look for all of these rules and he slowly discovers more and more rules and then he says to himself arrogantly, oh, surely there must come a day when we can explain everything through these rules and we do not have to believe in no creator. Surely we will find a rule that explains why all of this exists why everything is, is exactly how it is, how everything is just like I can see it. Surely we will find that out. It would be ridiculous to believe in a creator. Look how much we have already discovered through all kinds of rules. Surely we will discover more. And there he goes. He goes to discover more rules. He goes to discover even more and more rules and he keeps in his endless search for the one rule to explain it all, the theory of everything, yet he never finds it. And now we should be thinking, is this the case for us? Should we be saying that surely there is no creator, surely one day everything will be explained by the rules of this world, why everything exists exactly how it is? and how we see it, why everything is and works seemingly perfectly. Should we be arrogant like Steve and say that surely there must be no creator? Or should we maybe say, it seems like this world could very well be created. Now, of course, we know that the world that Steve exists in is created. But Steve cannot observe the higher realm which we exist in, which we created him in. And so he can never see and find out the reality of his realm. He can never discover every part of his own world to the same degree that we can. We will always have more knowledge of it because we created it. We can see the code which Minecraft is written in. We can explore everything. We can even change things in Minecraft. We could change the code to be a very different kind of game. Yet Steve has no control over this, no knowledge of this. So how does this apply to us? I mean, surely our world is so much more complex and so much grander than Minecraft that this surely couldn't apply to our world. Surely we can say that there is no creator. Surely we can say that, you know, this is just a bad example because Minecraft is clearly a video game. But that's what it seems like to us because we have the knowledge. But once again, just like Steve doesn't see the higher realm that created Minecraft, we don't see the higher realm that created us. And so for us to go around arrogantly saying that Surely everything will be explained in the future and I do not need to believe in no creator at all. I mean, that is a stretch. Now, of course, we should search for these rules of the universe. Of course, we should try to understand the universe. Not just because it will probably lead us closer to our creator, but simply to help us. Science has improved our lives such a great deal that certainly just to improve our own lives it's worth looking into science. But to say that this world is not created, to say that oh science will one day explain everything, I think that 
is an arrogant claim, equally arrogant to Steve, who might say that one day he will discover everything. But as we know, Steve will never discover the reality of Minecraft, because it's impossible from within. In the same way, it could very well be impossible for us to understand this world completely and this vast universe that we exist in without an outside perspective. And so for us to say that one day we'll be able to explain everything is extremely arrogant. And for us to assume that there is no creator is also extremely arrogant. But hey, that's just a theory, a game theory. <laughs>